It's Now Again. Welcome back to It's Now Again, the podcast where we explore mindfulness practices from a secular, evidence-based perspective. I'm your host, Jeremy West, and today we're diving into a practice that you can integrate into your daily life in a very tangible way, mindful eating. We all eat, but how often do we really pay attention to what we're eating, how we're eating, and the sensations that arise during the experience? Mindful eating is about bringing full awareness to the act of eating from the moment you take your first bite to the moment you finish your meal. It's about experiencing food with all of your senses, savoring each bite and being present with the nourishment you're giving your body. So what exactly is mindful eating? At its core, mindful eating is a practice that encourages us to slow down and fully engage with the eating process. It's about paying attention to the colors, smells, textures, flavors, even the sounds of the food we eat. It's about noticing the body's hunger and fullness cues and eating with intention rather than out of habit or emotional triggers. The practice of mindful eating has its roots in Buddhist teachings where mindfulness is applied to all aspects of life, including eating. In recent years, this ancient practice has been embraced by the scientific community, with research showing that mindful eating can help reduce overeating, improve digestion, and promote a healthier relationship with food. For example, one study found that participants who practiced mindful eating were more likely to lose weight and keep it off compared to those who did not engage in mindfulness practices. Another study reported that mindful eating can help reduce emotional eating and increase enjoyment of food, leading to better overall well-being. Now, let's talk about how you can start incorporating mindful eating into your daily life. The first step is to bring your full attention to the act of eating. This means turning off distractions like the TV or your smartphone and really focusing on your meal. Before you take your first bite, take a moment to appreciate the food in front of you. Notice the colors, the arrangement, and the aroma. Take a deep breath and as you exhale, allow yourself to be fully present with your meal. As you begin to eat, slow down, take smaller bites, and chew each bite thoroughly. Pay attention to the taste and texture of the food in your mouth. Notice how it changes as you chew. When you swallow, take a moment to feel the sensation of the food moving down your throat and into your stomach. Another key aspect of mindful eating is tuning into your body's hunger and fullness cues. Before you start eating, ask yourself how hungry you are on a scale of 1 to 10. As you eat, periodically check in with yourself to see how full you're feeling. Mindful eating isn't about finishing everything on your plate. It's about eating until you're satisfied, not stuffed. It's also important to recognize any emotional triggers that might influence your eating habits. Are you eating because you're hungry? Or are you eating because you're bored, stressed, or sinking in comfort? By becoming aware of these triggers, you can start to break the cycle of emotional eating and develop a healthier relationship with food. Mindful eating is not about perfection. It's about practice. Some days you might find it easier to be fully present with your meal, while other days you might find your mind wandering. That's okay. The key is to approach your eating experience with curiosity and kindness without judgment. As you continue to practice mindful eating, you might notice that your relationship with food begins to change. You might find yourself enjoying your meals more, eating less, and feeling more satisfied with what you eat. You might also discover that you have more control over your eating habits and that you're better able to respond to your body's needs. If you're interested in exploring mindfulness further, or if you'd like to work with me one-on-one, 
You can find more resources and information about my mindfulness coaching services, as well as a pay what you want Patreon, where you can access guided meditations, including one specifically designed to help you practice mindful eating. You can find all of this at jeremywest.net. Thank you for joining me today on It's Now Again. If you found this episode helpful, please subscribe, share it with others who might benefit, and leave a review. Remember, the present moment is always here, waiting for you to return to it. Until next time, I'm Jeremy West, reminding you to slow down, savor your meals, and eat with mindfulness, because... It's now again.